when you're a sales development rep, you're never going to be on a call. You're just scouring the web, so to speak. And you're just looking for prospects who look like they fit the bill. You're offering them a question. Hey, by the way, our company solves X, Y, and Z problem. Is this worth a call to you? If that person then goes to an appointment setter, then goes to a closer and closes a deal, that sales development rep makes a percentage on every close. So it's a win-win basis. Yes, it's labor intensive, but you can earn a lot of money. As an appointment setter, it's not manually intensive, but you do need skills in terms of your vocal ability because you're going to be on calls all the time, qualifying people. You need to put your company on a pedestal, show how great you are, show examples of clients you work with, let them relate to it. But these skills, these communication skills will not work as a closer. So when you come through the sales cycle from maybe an SDR to an appointment set to a closer, your skills will have to change.